Greetings, and welcome to me talking about random stuff. So, since I'm such a slowpoke, I thought I would create a video about how to hotkey again, and about my recent discovery of Naramon. So, if you're like me, you probably chose something else, like Zenuric, or Vazarin, or Nairu, I, I don't know what the proper pronunciation of those things are. But I chose Zenuric, which provides you with energy overflow and uh, other stuff. So, Naramon. Narmon is a incredible kind of thing because of Shadow Step, which gives you invisibility every time you crit with a melee weapon on any character. So it's not just Loki, Vara, or Ash. Everyone gets invisibility. So I thought I would just create a small update on auto hotkey and how it works with melee weapons. And Narmon. Okay, so I got my hammer. I got my fragger, which I got on the yesterday. I got lucky with the drops. And I got my Narmon. As you can see, I'm already invisible. I just got a few crits and I'm using the Blood Rush build. So, Narmon provides you invisibility every time you crit. Blood Rush gives you red crits, which means you always crit. Which, I don't know, I think it's kinda OP, because if you don't fuck up, you basically can go on with survival forever. So regardless, I'm here because of auto hotkey. As you can see, you can actually <coughs> attack pretty fast. Not insanely fast, but after a while you might get tired. And that's when auto hotkey comes in. So, you just enable one script. I use the uh, thumb mouse button, and right now I'm not pressing my left mouse click. Or E, I don't know what e people use. I'm just holding one button down and Walker attacks for me. Which I'd say is really, really convenient. So, this is Planet Auto Hotkey. After a long survival with Naramon, you might get tired. Instead, you should just use a auto hotkey script. I heard some mouses actually have uh, uh, built in functionality for it, so you can just spam keys when you feel like it. My mouse is not like that. My mouse just has the sensitivity adjustment. And that's about it. So yeah, as you can see, so I was going well, they ignore me completely, they just run up to me and turn around. I don't know, I think it's okay. Now I'm gonna tell you how to make a script for auto hotkey. So first of all, you obviously need the program itself, the auto hotkey. So you go to the official site, download it, and install. I don't think you need much explanation of that. After that, you can just create a new text file, name it whatever you want, for instance, thumb, mouse, click. After that, you get some kind of script, and just paste it here, and save it. After that, you name it from txt to ahk, which will transform it into the auto hotkey script. After that you just enable it, and you're done. So you can go to Google and uh, check the tutorials, check the forum threads. You have a large wall of text for it, and it's kind of intimidating. And there's just more and more and more. So if you actually want to get into it, I suggest you read all this. But if you just want a simple script to actually play the game, you should just stick with forms. So just copy and paste this script, or this script, or this script. You have a lot of options. You can do uh, the same thing in different kind of ways. Everyone has their own way. But I have my own, which is uh, this. 
So Warframe uses the one of the Tom buttons as uh, back, and I bound one uh, as fuck. one of the Tom buttons as, uh, for instance, exploding the projectiles of Simulor or stuff like that, you know, secondary fire. But I have two thumb buttons, so this is the second one. This means which button is going to be pressed to initiate the script. This uh, is going to ensure the script is going to be repeated and not just end after being executed once. This will make sure so if you are not pressing these buttons, nothing will happen. But if you actually do, the click will happen. Why is there a P? I don't know, because uh, I think I just copy pasted this and kept P in. It's not exactly the most used button, so I didn't pay much attention to it. But if you press this button, you will actually spam the mouse clicks. As you can see, this is me pressing that button. And this is me just doing normal mouse clicks. As you can see, the speed is really, <laughs> really slow compared to what the script can do. So this concludes this tutorial, if you can actually call this a tutorial.